They're built by adults and you see more adults gathering around them than anything at all. But I'm in a booth right now featuring Thomas the Train, my very first Thomas and Friends Railway Pals Rescue Tower. So this is if you have a kid who you think maybe wants to get involved, this is the place to come here at the Kansas Depot. And check this out. They actually have an anniversary, a special edition train. Did you know that Thomas the Train, when he was first built, was carved out of a broom handle. How cool is that? And in fact, Thomas the Train is known for having wooden tracks, wooden cars on a wooden track. It's been around since the 1940s. And Thomas the Train was one of the trains that got you started with your grandfather. This is Jake. He is one of the owners of the Kansas Depot. And you have a rich history of your own with Thomas the Train. Oh yeah, uh, it's something I played with when I was a kid and it's something that my grandpa sold in his pharmacy when I was a kid so that was something I always grew up with and became really familiar with and he started doing these shows and I kind of just grew up with the Thomas the Train and these shows. And and these are really neat. There's so many little additions you can get, but uh, you've got your favorite starter kit if a family wants to get started because there's so many different pieces. Oh, yeah. But this really kind of bundles it all together. The coal hopper? Yep. Uh, this is uh, my favorite just because it's a, it's a great bargain, really, and it's something that we've had here in our booth for a long I mean, we've sold it here for quite a bit, quite a while. Now, when we're talking about Thomas the Train, all of these trains have faces on them. That makes it a little bit different than some of the other trains that we're seeing in other vendors. And what kind of feedback do you get from parents and customers? Um, well, I get a lot of stuff from parents that talk about how it helps their kids communicate with the, or it, it helps them learn to communicate with their friends and stuff if they have maybe some challenges with that. Because of the faces on the trains, they can sort of make little trains and cars talk to each other. Oh yeah, and it and it helps them with building creativity. There's all sorts of stuff that Thomas ha has its advantages with. Well, and I, I love that there's actually, there's of course cartoons and YouTube videos, and there's a book with a lot of the stories that go along with these trains. There's this massive book with all kinds of stories inside so you can learn about the journeys that these cars take and their relationships. And some of the cars that you buy, uh, Jake was showing me here. This is really neat. Uh, I think it's this one. Merlin the Invisible on the back. There's actually a description of the personality. Meet the interesting outsider. He may look different, but that just means he's unique. His appearance makes him hard to notice. His friendly, helpful personality makes him impossible to ignore. I love that. The, the unique personalities of the train car really help teach kids to appreciate the uniqueness in others. Oh, yeah, they're, they're all unique. That's, that is for sure. <laughs> we, we have so many different ones. It's, it takes people a long time to really decide which one they want sometimes. <laughs> Well, I, I love it. This has been a passion of yours. It's been in your family, and, and I know you love getting families and kids excited about building their own train on the original sort of wooden tracks. Uh, what are the hours today? When can they come and see you here? Um, we're open here from 10 to 4 today, so as long as you're here before 4, we'll be open and ready to help you find anything you're looking for here. All right, fantastic. And Jake has played with everything he sells, I believe. Oh, he's yeah. probably he's probably even played <laughs> in the tents and worn the onesies. <laughs> uh, they've got it all here at the Kansas Depot. And, of course, a, a big variety here at the train show. We'll be exploring all morning long. Back to you. Um,